Boy, I have to follow that. <laughs> uh, this has been a great day. Uh, and uh, as Eric uh, pointed out, uh, I was uh, a member of the Russell Sage uh, Foundation Board of Trustees from 1988 to uh, 1998 and chair of the board for three years. And based on my knowledge of this organization, I do not hesitate to say that no other foundation in the country has done more to foster good basic research on social issues. And under the visionary leadership of Eric Warner, the foundation has not only generated important research programs, it has also helped to break down disciplinary barriers by bringing together scholars from different fields to work on similar problems. Now given time constraints, let me take about three minutes to highlight the Foundation's recent research programs on the problems of the disadvantaged. The scope of the research boggles the mind. Take, for example, the multi-city study of urban inequality initiated in 1992 with support from the Ford, Ford Foundation. The program brought together more than 40 scholars from 15 universities to conduct research on the persistence of high rates of joblessness among minorities in America's central cities. Focusing on four large metropolitan areas, the investigators representing different academic disciplines produced a series of impressive studies on how the interaction of labor markets residential segregation, and racial stratification affect employment outcomes. Or consider the Foundation's partnership with the Carnegie Corporation in launching a research program to examine differences in educational quality and opportunity, family well-being, health care, legal services, neighborhoods, and several other dimensions of social inequality. This project features several working groups that include scholars from different disciplines, each based at a particular university or research center investigating one or more of these problems. Finally, take the Foundation's Future of Work program which supports research on the causes and consequences of the long-term deterioration in the quality and availability of jobs, as well as declining real wages for low-skilled workers. Researchers, again, from different academic disciplines, have been funded to investigate the impact of the computer revolution, cheap foreign labor, competition from low-skilled immigrants, the weakening of the union movement, and the decline in the real value of the minimum wage on less educated workers. This research program includes in-depth case studies on how, the, how employer decisions in response to globalization, improvements in information technology, and industry deregulation in hundreds of U.S. firms affect millions of low-skilled workers. Finally, the Foundation established a working group to study the impact of rising incarceration on the labor market experiences of less educated minority workers, a working group that once again includes scholars from different academic disciplines. To repeat, no other foundation 
can match Russell Sage creative leadership in advancing basic social science research on some of the most vexing social problems confronting our nation. Thank you.